Hey, what's up, you two? I'm Steph. I know that I said I was a ski racer, but Fortunately, I can't ski right now, so I'm gonna be doing a little workout routine. This is something that I've been doing the last few days. I'm loving it. So I subluxed my shoulder about three weeks ago. I haven't been able to do a lot of weightlifting because it was just sore and like nervy pain. So today's gonna be the first day that I get back lifting actual weights. I'm gonna start First, with a little YouTube spin workout because normally my spike workouts are very structured and they just get really repetitive. Yeah, let's get going. We're gonna start the spin workout and then we'll get into the weight lift. Okay, so I picked my workout. My mom asks me this all the time, but since quarantine, people, workout channels especially, have been posting a ton of videos that you can follow. I just searched on YouTube 20 minute spin class or 30 or 45, whatever I'm in the mood for. There's so many videos, they're really fun. That's an easy way to get a workout in. Just look it up on YouTube. <laughs> God, that was really sweaty. <laughs> I'm just gonna cool down for a second and then get into warm up. Before we lift any type of weight or like do anything really, we have to warm up. If you have ever lifted before or you are older than like 15, I think you usually recognize that you have to warm up before you do things because things get sore. Our bodies are aging. <laughs> Two types of warm up. We're gonna do just like a dynamic one and then a banded one to get all our little muscles firing so that when I go lift, it's not gonna tear everything in my body. So obviously I'm not at the gym. Um, there's this thing called Corona that uh, closed a lot of things up here in Canada. So <laughs> this is my gym. Um, we like to call this one the converted guest bedroom gym. Time to lift weights. So our first thing is gonna be rear foot elevated split squats, medicine ball crunches, deadlifts, and then knee push-ups for my shoulders. Let's do the first one. Okay, first set's done. <laughs> My body is already feeling sore. Next set is back squats, Russian twists, three-way hamstrings, which are super fun, and plank. So basically, this whole workout is so that I can get like my legs going, my core going a little, and then doing my rehab integrated with the, also that wasn't a fart, that was my ball. <laughs>
Okay, I've done seconds that I'm kind of running out of energy, but we have one more set and then we're done. We're gonna do deadlifts, side bends, single leg jumps onto this lovely thing and bent over rows. Thank God, my legs are already sore. When we're in season, we do a lot less strength just because we're usually skiing all the time. But since I'm doing a little bit of rehab, I have a few days to do a couple lifts, get some strength back. This maybe isn't the most entertaining video you've ever watched, but this is like very realistic. Skiers get injured a lot. I don't know any amateur or pro ski racer that has made it their entire career with getting injured in some way. So there are a lot of points in your career where you have to take a few weeks off. You're more in the gym doing rehab, building strength. So this is just very realistic. Honestly, the race season is only like four months of the year and the other eight are spent working out or doing stuff like I'm doing right now. I'm gonna do some rehab now for my shoulder. Basically what I do is I have one of these bands again, and I go through all my physio exercises. I'm gonna go through a couple of my shoulder exercises because I know there are a lot of people that have, I mean, you don't have to be a ski racer to have shoulder issues. It's not just skiers, it's actually most athletes or just people in general. First one is just pulling straight up. This one's to the side. Because going up is definitely the worst. Okay, then the other way you pull in. Pretend you're giving someone a high five. Those are my band ones. I, that's it. Okay, this is where I'm ending this video. I'm honestly getting bored of my day. This is my life right now. I'm so excited to start skiing in a few days. It's, feels like it's been a year, but it's honestly been like two weeks, so. <laughs> um, if you like this, let me know, subscribe. I mean, I won't blame you if you don't, but I'll keep posting new videos. This was just like a rehab, what I'm doing right now, show you that there's more to ski racing than just skiing. There's a lot of other stuff that goes into it. I hopefully will be doing more fun stuff soon. So stick around. I'm also starting school again in a week. So we'll have online classes, skiing, working out, racing. So much fun stuff coming up. <laughs> Thanks for watching. I appreciate you. I'm really excited to be starting this. So see you in the next video.